chairs, fellow delegates, and um, esteemed guests. Um, this delegate believes that the solution presented is an excellent way to solve the problem and um, because it will help students and teachers, all, all parties feel safe going to school and learning or doing their job. Um, um, first, first of all, um, in, in subclause A, I propose that we protect our schools by putting down, um, by deploying soldiers um, there. After we have our schools, as some of you propose to free up the schools by putting refugees elsewhere, how will we know that they will be safe from being destroyed by, by terrorists or being attacked? Um, this delegate, delegate's proposition of putting down ground forces will make schools seem like too much trouble to attack. Terrorists will think twice before attacking Iraqi children. Um, we all need to come together and um, give troops the help. Secondly, as seen in su subclause B, we will make a push to make schools a neutral zone. If all parties involved can promise not to attack schools, we can feel much more confident investing money into their education system. Um, seeing, seeing that the ideas presented are effective and highly beneficial to, to the issue at hand, this delegate believes that um, that we have that this this will work. Um, Genghis Khan once said, "Not even a mighty warrior can break a frail arrow when it is multiplied and supported by his fellows. As long as you brothers support one another and render assistance to one another, your enemies can never gain the victory over you. But if you fall away from each other, your enemy can can break you like a frail arrow one at a time."